all players. So once again, Frumpy Dub has let his tiny ketchup stained fingers write a check that his ass is going to have to cash in the court of law. And I'm going to keep it a stack. I love this for him. Y'all, please go ahead and grab your tea and have a seat. Let's talk about the special counsel Jack Smith's request and Frumpy Dump Cracker Jack Box legal team response. So as we all know, honey, Frumpy Dump scurred his ass on down there to Washington, D.C. to be arraigned on those charges related to election interference. Now he pled not guilty, but according to reports, honey, Frumpy Dump does all that big talking on social media, but he was scared to look special counsel Jack Smith in the eye. Baby, they said that Jack Smith was staring at his ass. Woo! If I could have just temporarily been a fly on that wall, it would have been the best day of my life. So during the arraignment, the judge made it a point to remind Frumpy Dump that it is a crime to try to influence any witnesses in this case. But y'all know Frumpy Dump thinks he's above the law, honey. He don't give a damn about none of that shit. So he scurried his ass on over to Devil is a Lie Social and said, if you go after me, I'm coming after you. I declare, honey. What a disgrace. Trump, you're so dumb. So Jack Smith goes and pulls this actual post and uses it in his request for a protective order in the election interference case. Oh, yes, 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 honey. Late in the midnight hour, prosecutors pointed to a Frumpy Dump Truth social post from earlier in that day to argue that Frumpy Dump has a habit of speaking publicly about details of various legal proceedings he's facing. Special counsel is arguing that they can't trust that Frumpy Dump will not scurry his ass on over to Devil is a Lie Social and post any of the discovery material. So they're asking for a discovery disclosure rule. In the filing, they outlined the back and forth they had behind the scenes with Frumpy Dump's team over their proposed order. They also pointed to comments that Frumpy Dump's attorney made during the indictment, stressing that the defense would not be able to propose a trial date or expected length, as the judge had requested, until they had a chance to review the scope of the evidence involved in the case. So if they share any of that information with Frumpy Dump, they cannot trust that Frumpy Dump won't scurry his ass on over to devil is a lot social and post anything. They're basically saying, look, Frumpy Dump is unhinged. He cannot be trusted and his attorneys cannot control him. Now the judge reviewed the case and this morning she came back and gave Frumpy Dump's Cracker Jack Box legal team until August 7th at 5 o'clock to respond. So in response to that, Frumpy Dump Cracker Jack Box legal team asked for more time. I declare, what a disgrace. Now Frumpy Dump's legal team ain't that smart. But this could be a strategy to delay things. You know they want this trial to occur after the election. This whole thing could blow up in their faces, if it is a strategy. Players, put your thoughts in the comments. This is Double D Mobile for the Black Here News.